What's up guys, Peter Von Panda here. Just bought myself this uh, illuminated hat. It's kind of like a winter stocking cap. And I showed you one of these before, but this one's a little bit different. So it's kind of just a skull beanie. Yeah, I think nylon, but it feels kind of like a, uh, you know, like a stocking cap. And here is the lighting element itself. The power button looks like it's right in the front in the middle. So when you're wearing this thing and this is on your forehead, you can just hit that. It might be a little hard to see here, but there's four LED elements, right? One, two, three, four, right? Oh, just like that. And they're pretty bright. If I hit it again, it goes a little dimmer. Hit it a third time, a little dimmer. Fourth time off. So uh, you have this little slightly frosted. It's a transparent like piece of plastic right there and then a little bit of this plastic uh, nylon surround which is holding it in now the interesting thing about this is that it's detachable I believe and so oh it just pulls out just like that so it just kind of slips in and out and what that does or what it allows you to do one it allows you to remove this piece and plug it in to a USB port to re recharge it. So you don't have to worry about the batteries, uh, replacing those, like a watch battery, anything like that. You just plug it into a USB port, recharge it. Um, you could use this little lighting element on its own, presumably. I don't know why you'd need to do that. And this little plastic piece just fits over that. Um, but then you can put it right back in the hat. So even if you don't have a working light here the hat still works but then you can easily recharge it you know off a power bank your laptop uh, a charging block etc so i really thought this was pretty cool so pretty awesome uh, little lit beanie so i got the hat on here pretty comfortable i've got a huge head and so finding hats that don't like strangle the blood uh from my brain are pretty rare but this one feels really comfortable the light is uh, angled up at whatever angle your forehead is going to be at. So, you know, hopefully it's just kind of a bright, uh, wide pattern so I can, you know, have light on things in front of me. But let's try it out in the dark and find out. Light the beanie on, and if I just turn it on there, uh, you can see here. Um, I'm pretty impressed, actually, as I'm kind of looking down in front of me. It might be a little hard to see, but the ground is really well illuminated. Actually, this would be perfect for, like, snow blowing early in the morning. My snow blower has a light on it, but this is kind of casts a really wide, you know, soft light on a lot of things. If I hit it again here, it goes to a little lower setting, um, you know, and it's a little dimmer. Yeah, it's going to be hard to show you on camera here. The third setting is lower, even still, and then off. But... When it is on, this is definitely, if it were totally dark out like this in the morning and I was snow blowing, this is giving me, uh, you know, illumination, you know, five to 10 feet out on either side of me uh, and probably 10 feet, 10 to 15 feet out in front of me, just a soft illumination. And so I'm pretty impressed with this. If you're going out for walking the dog, um, just kind of a light stroll, you kind of just need to see things illuminated, but you don't need a really bright light, then this is perfect, especially in cold climate. So I'm pretty impressed with it. The lighted beanie that's not only uh, lit, but removable and rechargeable via USB port. I'm pretty impressed with it. Peter Von Panda out.